The University of Mississippi's South Oxford Center is up and running with organizations moving in. The first university organization to move in was the Counselor Education Clinic for Outreach and Personal Enrichment, or COPE. That is an organization that focuses on mental health and school counseling for children, adults, and families. Originally at Insight Park, clinical director Alexandra Kernum said the new move has given them more space. We love it. You know, it's, it's quiet, like you said. Um, it's a bigger space. It's like the space was built for us because we have um, a break room where we had our fridge in the closet over at Insight Park. Um, there's just enough offices for all of us. Um, we have enough counseling rooms, we have the playrooms, and then we have a big office or a big room at the end of the hall for a conference room. COPE isn't the only organization that has moved into the old hospital. Living Blues Magazine is also calling the hospital home. Publications manager for the magazine, Melanie Young, says they were previously located on the fourth and fifth floors of Lamar Hall, but they are looking forward to taking advantage of what the old hospital offers. But, you know, we're very happy to be over here because we have all of our on-campus, you know, operations and office space and storage space all in one location. And, um, and I'm going to be very interested to see, um, you know, how the building itself progresses over time and all of the different things that they've got planned for this space. The university purchased the old 485,000 square foot hospital back in June 2017. But it officially took over this past March. The building is aiming to have the remaining seven tenants move in the hospital by January. Annie Mapp, Newswatch, Ole Miss.